poppin everybody it's your girl talitha welcome or welcome back to my channel starting the day well i can't even say starting the day starting the afternoon off with our bloom green drink 30 ingredients in just one drink and there's so many health benefits into drinking your vegetables because who wants to eat them not talitha so make sure you guys check out bloom down below this week let me let me put y'all down because my arm kind of hurt this is our preparation maintenance vlog for jamaica i'm so excited to like go and it's not a brand trip it's one of my internet friends it's her birthday and she invited a bunch of other influencers so it kind of feels like a brand trip even though it's just a bunch of influencers they all feel like brand trips at this point <laughs> i'm very excited even though there's tea already already like we ain't even leave yet and there's already tea but i digress while i'm here we need to get our nails done with wax um i wanted to get my hair done but that's not gonna happen so the braids are staying in and then i think that's kind of it yeah i'm really not doing too much to be honest with y'all i should not have gone financially but i said screw it it's a tax write-off you know i'm here for the memories here for the content so i finally have a drone for like all this overhead footage that you guys know and love and makes it look more like a movie we are gonna go rent one i think hopefully it'll come in time but that's the plan and then obviously based on the outfit we're going to the gym We are outside the gym right now. I went to the nail shop, walked in, saw the line, and walked right out. Like I, I don't, I didn't have time. Okay, I don't have time because it's, it's a workout. It's a body pump day, and I intend to pump the body very hard. <laughs> Sorry, I'm like switching my shoes because I had slides on. I wasn't gonna talk about this online, but it's something I'm very passionate about and very excited for is becoming a group fitness instructor. I'm gonna get certified, I think, at the end of this month to start teaching because I've been taking body pump for like four, since the pandemic, four years now, and I love it. And it's one of those classes that literally I take three times a week. I encourage everyone else to take it. I'm like, body pump, <laughs> let's do it, let's go. Even though it's hard, it's definitely a workout where like, you get an intro to movements, how to work out properly. And I think that's helped me so much because the body has transformed like crazy. So I'm excited about it. We are going to Miss Body Pump and then we're gonna do probably a few back workouts, I think. And then um, do some cardio with my sister. I'm pretty sure a lot of you have noticed. I am very much a lot, okay run that back <laughs> i am much more spiritually active than i used to be and i love that for us like i really 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 do and honestly i'm not even gonna lie to y'all i'm struggling in every aspect of my life besides spiritual and i'm like kind of okay with that because if anything is going to struggle i'm glad it's not my relationship with god and then it got me thinking like had i not moved had i not been in that relationship and got hurt had i not done all the steps i needed to i wouldn't be here right now this version of talitha is my favorite i'm excited for this year okay like the things that god has told me to do that i'm like actively working on lots of big things and i'm excited y'all we were going through it for a minute i'm not even gonna lie we were down bad like terribly <laughs> like i don't know even when nothing is really going well i have the confidence in God that it will turn around. But cheers, Celsius. I told myself I was gonna stop drinking it, but that's a lie. Sweat mustache, Yiddies shall not be exposed. Thou shalt. They're weary. 
<laughs> They're weary and well doing. <laughs> Thou shalt let them yiddies shake. That's Ephesia yiddies. Ecclesiastes. <laughs> you gotta get that out of the The following day. This is the color. <laughs> Look, she don't know I got this thing right now. So I keep looking over here because I can see myself. Ooh, not that skin. Hold on. Oh my goodness. I keep looking over there because I'm like, hey. She don't know I got this. So we're going to keep this between us. But hey, y'all, I had to sneak a little hello up in here into the, into the, into the vlog. Hey, vlog. <laughs> Yeah, um, I ain't got enough for you, that's about it. Okay, back to our regularly scheduled program. Hello everyone, happy Tuesday. Continuing this maintenance week, um, I just got my nails done. Low key, not a fan. Not a fan at all, like my toes are cute. I love my Vietnamese nail spa, okay, Cindy be hooking me up with the, t the pedicures, love the pedicures. And I forgot why I never get my nails painted there and I, um, don't get me wrong, she did a good job, but she just did not listen to what I wanted. I told her I wanted a French tip. Why? Why is half my nail painted? Like, I hate that. And then this nail is crooked. Like, it's giving Gumby. I'm not a fan. Y'all know usually I just do my nails myself, and I'm gonna take it off and redo it. I told her. I said, can you make it shorter? Like, I don't like long French tips. And she was like, no, because it's your natural nail. And I'm like, well, when I do my natural nails, I put it higher up and she's like no we can't do that so I was like you know what that's fine do what you want but I'm not paying for this don't really like them the toes eat though the toes are eating they are ready to be sucked on unfortunately that is not the case until further notice but <laughs> right now we're sitting outside I'm about to get my eyebrows done <laughs> I got the drive, the bus, the truck, the gas is stuck. I ain't the one to rely on the luck. I put in work and then he show up. I know it's faith that's in the rap ain't no regrets. I do too much. It ain't me if you see and I stunt. He calling the place and I do what he want. This ain't a front. Glory to G-O-D. It's what you could do with a mustard seed. It's what you could do when you start to believe. Take fear and you cast it inside of the sea. A hundred percent out of me. Cause he gave it all on the T when he let it bleed. So what is you saying to me? You just insecure about the love that turned me to a beast. The following day. Hello vlog, happy Wednesday. I'm gonna give y'all the agenda for today. We are going to pick up my drone because if you watch my St. Lucia vlog, my management like recorded a lot of really cool clips with the drone and I rented one and I'm like, I'm just gonna buy it cause it'll be fun. And, and then we're going to get my armpits waxed <laughs> and then we're going to the gym and then we're going to Bible study and then we're gonna take pictures. So it's a lot of things going on. Neptune, would you like to say hi to the vlog? I've been very selfish with my Neptune. He took his do rag off, I'm so weak. <laughs> Here, I'll let you I love this. a secret message there when you know it's only between us. A secret message. A secret message there when you know it's between us. Well, we're gonna give a public, first of all, how you done? The body's about to waste, oh, hold on. 
What waste? Oh my God, this winter complexion, I'm myself. There we go. Oh, okay, hey, waste too. It's not a secret message, y'all know that's between us. Don't tell her about it, it's not her business. Um. Secret message. Between T Hive and I, that's our thing. Nah, what's going on? Shout out to Talitha Jane and Tabitha, Sister Tabitha. Sister Tabitha. Sister Jane. <laughs> she can't stand that. <laughs> So it's a week and Tabitha for doing my hair. Look, first of all, you were falling asleep. I was asleep. Yeah, I'm gonna insert that picture. Oh my God, <laughs> not before me. Not before me. Yes, till Sunday. <laughs> and I was like, I told him, keep his expectations low. Like it'll be done, but it may not last that long. And as we were doing it, I was like, they don't look bad. They look like maybe two, three week, <clears throat> two, three week old you know, locks, it's not terrible. And she goes, yeah, they look a little weary. That's not good, boy. <laughs> if anybody's interested in vocal lessons, go to the link in my bio on Instagram and go to my link tree. And it says vocal lessons with Nap. And yeah, I do consultations, free 30 minute consultations. Tabiris, you wanna say hi? It's like, the big baby. Oh, my son. <laughs> You just oh. drag that gum you down. You drag the gum. Ooh. Oh yeah, he was just Got outside of me. Dad. Father. Yeah. Would you like to give a word for my vlog? It's been a while. Ah. Uh, no. I need to place this order first. Oh, well you can do it when we come back. How about that? Okay, that'll work. You wanna say hi though? Hi. Hey. I'm <laughs> vloggers and bloggers and I always give a word. Quick word. Anything in particular? No, whatever you want. Whatever I want. Okay, so it's not about what we want. It's about what God wants. Mm. And we need to get out of the way so he can get in the way. Many times we don't get what we think we need because we are in the way. Because of what we mm. want, what we want to accomplish, what we want to get done. And it's really not about us. It's about what God wants to accomplish through us. And when we realize that and get out of our way, he can step in and get in the way. That's why you're the pastor. You did a good job, Dad. Thank you very much. Thank you. And I'm looking at the drones, even though I bought it online, we're just picking it up. I got this one. I'm out of breath because I just changed. Y'all, changing in the car is really a talent. You either have it or you don't. But I just put my outfit on. Super cute. We're about to go to one of my trusty, dusty, crusty, heavy on the crusty picture locations in Colorado, the staircase. My friend lives in this apartment building and I'm always like, hey girl, I'm gonna take pictures in your, in your staircase, can you let me in? And she's like, yeah. So I come here a lot. This is my spot. I'm telling you, if you're trying to grow your Instagram or you just need like an aesthetic place to take pictures, a staircase. I haven't taken pictures for Instagram in forever because I've been going on so many trips. I'm like, I'll just take pictures when I'm tripping you know that being said you already know what to do comment the little sparkle emoji on my instagram and you can get a shout out from me definitely starting to gear shift my content into more spiritual like god inspired like christian baddie <laughs> i'm calling it biblical baddie yeah y'all engage with this post like crazy because the vlog viewers know that this is y'all i'm like starting to starting to change a little bit and i'm like kind of sad but it's bittersweet i never thought in a million years that i would like turn into like a christian or like a godly or you know that type of influencer but the direction that god is taking my life I, i'm pretty sure y'all know the vlog viewers know it like the <laughs> the stove is on high okay like god just took it he turned the heat all the way up and i honestly like i love it definitely not gonna stop with the fashion because she is Mrs. Put It On, but I'm going to start doing it in a way that's more modest, 
kind of we could talk about that because I definitely have been I did not plan on talking about this right now but we're just gonna go for it God kind of told me like you can be fashionable without having to do all the stuff you've been doing like with my body type I feel like everything I wear regardless of if I'm showing skin or not is going to come off as more like sexualized just because I'm a curvier person but but however I'm getting to a place where I kind of want to clean up a little bit just just a little bit so if you guys go on my Instagram you probably noticed I archived a lot of pictures that are like certain poses that can be deemed kind of trashy or like um pictures with like my butt cheeks hanging out do not get me wrong though I am still miss free the leg all that body yaddy yaddy and that's not ever going to change but there's a way to do it without kind of like without doing too much you know it's like a growth thing and i'm really happy about it i'm really excited for like this little christian influencer type of vibe going on i'm really here for it and it's even crazier because at my church on sunday we had a guest pastor and he's he's great love him he came and he was like praying over people kind of prayed and prophesied over all of us he was pretty much telling me like the places god is going to take me we are god has already taken me so far and he said like in the world far like so far but he said he's going to take me even further spiritually and i can already see that happening just like within the past month you know i'm happy that that's happening inward but my dad says it should be a outward expressions of inward change are what matter so i'm really starting to work on that outward expression you know everything happens for a reason i was depressed in texas got my little heart broken and god flipped it and reversed it i knew social media was like my purpose and my calling but i think it was revealed to me this year like between the beginning of the year and now that not just social media but like being an example that i'm sorry i did not mean to go on this tangent right now but when it starts you can't stop it i am someone who's an advocate for christianity that you do not have to be perfect when you come regardless of how you present yourself physically that does not make you less of a person in god's eyes that does not make you less of a less of someone that he can use to work on work through work with i said i archived all these pictures on my instagram some of them but others i'm keeping up because i want to show that i wasn't perfect when god started working on me and i'm not going to give you this little perfect little christian woman who's been like that forever no because that's not the case one of my favorite song lyrics is like this gospel christian artist tommy zuko he says i'm not saying i'm perfect but i'm being perfected and i love that it it like articulates it so perfectly i love it here you guys i love it here it's fun time so that being said <laughs> i don't even know where all that came from another thing giving away a lot of clothes i'll probably show y'all when i get back to houston the mountain of clothes i have we're just we're parting ways with them save your money okay i'm telling you right now save like 200 dollars. okay just save like 200 dollars or like 150 ish around there um because i'm planning things and i don't want y'all to not have money when it happens so from here until like june get your coins together okay that's all i gotta say because a closet a closet clean out is one of the things i can't talk about anything else but just know, get your coins together okay save your monies save them because we working we cooking over here i really want to go to chick-fil-a <laughs> so i need to make it back before 10 o'clock and we are going to take these heels off because i cannot drive in these ginormous platforms do y'all see this this is a shoot this is a weapon the weapons formed against me are not prospering um but yeah okay let me <laughs> go home all right yes all right sir. all right thank you so much my pleasure you have a good one you too thank you <laughs> thank you so much have a good night the following day Great trip. Keep her safe while she's there. Bring her back safely. Bless all of our family. Help us. Keep us. Let us have a great day today in Jesus' name. Amen. Trip. Thank you. May Lord bless you and keep you real good. Bye bye. Thank you. <laughs>
we just got to the room. The room is cute. We're in a little room tour. Yeah. This is what you see when you first come in. Beds that I'm gonna sleep right in the middle because it's just me in here. Got a little couch moment. And one thing I love about myself is I'm very polite and my parents raised me with exceptional manners. And I feel like that and like just pretty privileged, like if we're being honest here, I've never stayed in a room that I booked in a hotel. I have been upgraded every single time. And that's on what God's favor, thank you Jesus. He upgraded my room because I had like a partial ocean view and he was like, well, since you can't be by your friends, I'll upgrade you to a full ocean view. So let's look at the view together for the first time. Let me get first reactions. Hold up, one second. Oh, it's so pretty. I need to figure out if this is a sunset or a sunrise, but it's so pretty. I want to stay on one of those. Do y'all see that? They're like little water, water villas. I'm gonna have to come back here with my man, and we're gonna we're gonna do that. That's like a dream of mine. So beautiful. And here is the bathroom. Cute. Nothing crazy. I look tired. I have not slept since I woke up at like noon yesterday. So we're going on 24 hours, and I just have to keep moving because if I don't, I'm going to like crash you're here for miss cynthia her birthday i don't know if you guys follow her on tiktok but we've been mutuals for a long time and then we met on a brand trip last year and she's just she's just a great person and i told y'all it's just influencers but i feel like i know everyone because we've just been following each other forever the plan is i'm about to take some pictures because that view and i think it's a sun oh it's about to eat y'all lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of pictures so prepare to be sick of me prepare to see pictures of me in jamaica for the next week like month actually all of march just prepare yourself now you know what it's crazy because i said i was going to stop drinking to get closer to god and then i come here <sighs> even my even my mom was like but you're on vacation and i'm like i know mom but it's not a challenge if you're only denying alcohol when it's not presented to you. But then what you're really paying for here is it's all inclusive. Like even the the bar that they have here, y'all, not the not the dispensers. Like even all of this, I paid for it. I could drink the whole bottle, have it refilled, drink it again, and it's paid for. I'd be kind of stupid to not come to Jamaica and be sober, you know? Maybe we'll just do like, I don't know. I said I was gonna do, I wanna do six months sober and I was just gonna take it one month at a time. But I think after this, we're gonna do Faith, one of the girls I was with, she's saying she only drinks once a month during like a special occasion. So like no social drinking, no influencer events, no like casual glasses of wine, like when she's out once a month and that's it. And I really like that because it still allows you to live your life, but not overindulge. So I think I'm gonna do that. But anyway, back to the plan, step one change and put some lashes on because i just i look tired because i am tired so we're gonna change put lashes on i'm very hungry i didn't eat today so when i get some food and then i think we're meeting either at the pool or the beach and we're gonna fly this drone because yeah honestly i just came here for the looks y'all it's eating already we starting out strong we got the t custom talitha earrings Whoever sent these to my P.O. box, thank you, because I love them. This little cover-up I just got from Fashion Nova. This swimsuit is also from Fashion Nova. I don't know, I've had it for years. I doubt you could even buy it anymore. Pool day, can we talk about that body? You guys, the gym is starting to treat your girl right. Yeah, just a moment of appreciation for the body. And then my shoes are also from Fashion Nova, but they're like super old, so. Yeah, I'm feeling myself. Oh, the sun just came out. I'm about to take some pictures and then I'm gonna meet them at the pool. Look at this. That's just everything. Eating like the colors, the body. 
Okay, but now I'm gonna go. No one's waiting for me, but I haven't seen anyone yet, so I'm excited to like meet everyone, eat, cause y'all. So I'm at this pool by myself. I got left. Well, not left, but they kind of like didn't really tell me where they were going, and yeah, it, it's a mess. So I kind of had a feeling that this was gonna happen. Like a lot of the girls here knew each other before coming, and I just mutuals. I'm gonna sit here. I was gonna go get my Bible, but. It's really peaceful right now. Like, it's just me and this pool and this view. And I'm gonna look at the pictures I just took, edit them, maybe post them, who knows. And then we have dinner at eight. So hopefully I can like formally meet everybody then. in here and I meet these wonderful beautiful people how you doing how you doing hey. all right all right new game destinies too you already know what's up watch her channel she's yes, awesome sir. yeah well thank you guys so yeah. much right, it's nice to meet you thank you you too have fun be safe I am getting changed for dinner I don't know if I'm gonna do this off the shoulder it looked cute like this at home but now I'm thinking I want to put it like how it's supposed to be Gotta lift up the kitties. <laughs> I think it's cute like that. So the birthday girl, Cynthia, she's tired, which is very much understandable. I still have yet to see her. I'm just gonna go eat somewhere on the resort. I'm just gonna, you know, take myself out. Like, why not, right? We're gonna put on a little blush. This is the one size. The name of this is crazy. Like, you're real out of pocket, Patrick. <laughs> it's called Cheek Clapper. Which is a double entendre because I don't I gotta do too much. I gotta say too much. Patrick, Patrick Star makes great makeup. I actually met him at Coachella and when I met him it affirmed so much. He was speaking to my soul and didn't even know he yeah, crazy. Here is the outfit. This set is actually from Shein, believe it or not. I haven't bought clothes from there in such a long time. This top that I was gonna wear off the shoulder, but like it won't stay, so I'm gonna sleep like this. And then cute little skirt. Clear sandals are from either Ross or Fashion Nova. I've had them for a while. We're gonna use this purse. Real cute. The following day. Good morning, everybody. Today's Friday. It is our boat day. Let me show you guys the swimsuit. This swimsuit gives me like bikini bottom, um, the sky on SpongeBob type of vibes. Like this is. It's so cute and girly, even though it's a very tiny, very tiny bikini. How do I, how do I put this on? We'll cover up from Shein. I will link all of my outfits, if I can find them, down below. Because I already know the girls are going to be like, Talitha, like where's that from? I got you. I got you, babe. Because I did not come to Jamaica and not have the outfits. Like, come on now. And then the bag I'm bringing is this, you know, my typical... Typical Prada travel bag. My shoes, I think I'm just gonna wear these because they're comfortable. I like it, I can get behind it. Adorable. I didn't eat breakfast this morning because I was very tired and skipped the entire meal. So hopefully we're not doing too much because I don't want to pass out and we're gonna be in the sun. That's like two strikes against me. I didn't think that one through. <laughs> it's okay. And I don't have any sunscreen because they took it at TSA. The Uber boat. The Uber boat. <laughs> We're at. Um, you probably can't even hear me. So I'm gonna yell a little bit. We're at a restaurant. Can I be my vlog? It's her birthday. Sadly. 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 We are back from the boat. Um, let me push y'all down and give you the tea. Cynthia paid ten thousand dollars for a private yacht. Private party, right? Private yacht party with food and like snorkeling and excursions and like, you know, that kind of thing. Not only was it not private, but it was not a yacht either. And we think, well, not even we think, the tour guide definitely scammed us because he's the one who booked it. Like she paid him and then he booked everything for her. So that makes me wonder like what other events are we doing? because we were talking to other people on the boat and that boat is $80 per person. She paid 10,000 and there's 17 of us and that math is not mathing to $80 per person. 
So she was very upset when we got there and we tried to make the best of it. It was still fun nonetheless, like, you know, we were turning up for the most part. Y'all, I still have not drink, drinking, drunk, drunk. I still have not drunk yet. So we're holding on, we're doing, we're doing great actually, but tonight is probably gonna be the night that changes that because it's the white party. My girl Gloria is here. I'm so excited to finally meet her. I didn't know she was gonna be here, but the resort is throwing an all white party and we just came back. I'm about to take a quick little shower and then we gonna get the party. I'm so excited, you guys. Have fun tonight. Lots of fun. We're listening to Eternal Sunshine, Ariana Grande's eighth, I wanna say, eighth album. If you didn't know this about me, I'm an Ariana Grande stan. Like, love that woman down. You can never make me hate her. Or Megan Thee Stallion. If there's two people I'm gonna ride for, I'm gonna stand beside them. I have a widow's peak, I don't know if you know that. And she never cooperates, but I laid her down. I'm trying to figure out if it's, if it's cute or if it's giving baby dill. You know, I really don't know. I don't, I think it's giving baby. It's not giving laid edges. Hello, everybody. Oh my gosh, y'all. Do you see me right now? Unwell. Like, Jamaica took everything from me in the worst and best way possible. <laughs> oh gosh, y'all. This trip, it, it took me the freak out. It is, I think, 6 in the morning. Um, 6.18 in the morning. It is our last day here. Honestly, after we went out last night, I was done because you know what happened we went out right to a club outside of the resort um i was being harassed by this man jamaica is a very unsafe place so be careful 
I'm walking. This man is literally giving me like rapey, touchy vibes. I'm walking, I'm like, dude, please back up, like stop. And no one else sees me struggling. I, I have heels on, like giant platforms. I'm trying to get this man away from me. I miss a step and I fall, y'all. I'm 5'9", 210 pounds. When I fall, I fall hard. So I have a ginormous cut in my knee right now and my phone broke. And what's crazy about it is their screen didn't crack, but my cameras shattered which is great because of course cameras my job yeah camera shattered cut on my knee roaches in my shower i'm like y'all get me out of here like i'm in the ghetto a shooting at the hotel because people are fighting <laughs> it's a mess it's a mess it's safe to say next time i come to jamaica i'm doing it the bougie way because we're staying at the rio i think it's what it's called and this is where people come like single people come to like hook up have a good time and that's great that's fine i'm not knocking that but that's not me more on the upscale luxury bougie side and i'm like let's sit by the beach drink go over bible verses like that's that's my speed but i am ready to go home i'm leaving in six hours so that's nice i stayed up all night editing the vlog we are going to do our instagram post shout outs it's been a minute since i've done them in case you didn't know comment the little sparkle sparkle emoji on my instagram and you guys can get a shout out from me i haven't really been posting on instagram but we're gonna change that the first shout out is going to miss Issa dawn because she commented can't wait for the vlog baby girl the vlog can't wait for you why do i feel light-headed i need to go to bed this is ridiculous. I'm ready to get up out of here, y'all. I'm telling you, Jamaica is crazy. <laughs> the second shout out is going to Ava Latrice. Ugh. I can't stop and the third shout out for this video is going to Miss Brown and Confident. Period. We love to see it. Brown and mad. I love it here. Y'all, I'm tapping out like Jamaica won. Jamaica got it. Um, will I come back? I want to, but next time i come back here i don't know when that will be but it, it yeah we'll, we'll cross that bridge when it's time to cross that bridge because look at me i look like i just spent the weekend in jamaica <laughs> but nonetheless i love you guys thank you so much for watching also thank you to cynthia for inviting me i had such a great time the girls were girling and we're already planning the next link up so i'm excited for that and then also of course thanking god for all the opportunities and the blessings and being able to literally do this for a job like my job is crazy and i love it so much and i'm so thankful for y'all's support but i love you complete the heart yeah did you do it did you do it are those birds real or my alarm yeah but i love you guys and i will see you on sunday